This is Lilac Moon. Today you're going to contact your plant spirit guide. Please like this video and subscribe for more meditations. Take a moment to get comfortable, either sitting or lying down. Get out any wiggles. Now close your eyes or relax your gaze. I want you to take a deep breath in through your nose and down into your belly. Feel it expand and release. Take another deep belly breath and release. We're going to take one more calming belly breath. I want you to draw your attention to your head. Breathe into your head. And on the exhale, feel your entire head relax. Next, we're going to breathe into your neck. And release. Now breathe into the back of your neck and exhale. Draw your attention to your chest. Breathe in a slow, beautiful breath and release. Now your belly. Breathe into your belly. and release. Next, draw your attention to your arms. Breathe deeply into your first arm. Release. Now your next arm. Let it go. I want you to breathe into your hands. Release. Feel how relaxed your arms and your hands feel. Now I want you to breathe into your back. First your upper back. Let it go. Now breathe into your lower back and release. Now breathe into your entire back, a slow, calming breath. Allow it to relax completely on your exhale. Now we're going to focus on your legs. First, breathe into one leg. Feel it release. Now, breathe into your other leg. And exhale. Next, we're going to breathe into both of your feet. Feel them relax. Now we're going to breathe into your entire body. Imagine the air flowing through the top of your head, going down your entire body and coming out your feet. Breathe in through your head. And out through your feet. Take in another breath down through your head, out through your feet. One last breath, in through your head, and out through your feet.
I want you to imagine you're standing in front of an old stone house. It's two stories high with a large yellow front door. The door opens and you walk into the house. When you enter, you walk through a cozy living room with comfortable afghans resting on the furniture. The living room is attached to a large kitchen with dried herbs hanging from the rafters and a large wooden dining room table next to the back door. The door opens and you follow it outside, leading downstairs into a beautiful garden. The garden goes on as far as your eyes can see. You've never seen so many flowers, fruits, vegetables, herbs, and trees growing in one place. Breathe in the smell of the garden. Listen to the birds. Take some time to watch the bees and butterflies flying from flower to flower. As you continue to walk through the garden, you notice a butterfly is trying to get your attention. It flies around your head and eventually lands on your shoulder. It flaps its wings three times and slowly flies in front of you. You follow the butterfly through the garden. She takes you to an area surrounded by a short metal fence. She leads you through an open gate and you realize it's an herb garden. Rosemary, almost as tall as you, is growing by the gate. You rub your fingers on a leaf and smell the pungent scent. You continue following the butterfly, smelling the herbs as you go. You travel past thyme, marjoram, lavender, calendula. The butterfly stops and begins circling over a small pond. On one edge of the pond is a flat rock that the butterfly lands on. You sit down next to the butterfly and watch as she flies to a nearby bush and begins drinking from a flower. You take in a deep breath and before you the soil begins to vibrate and move. You see a plant beginning to grow up and out of the ground. You watch and wonder as it grows to its full maturity. The plant tells you that it is your plant spirit guide and it can help you with whatever you need. It gives you its name. You can talk to your plant spirit guide about whatever you wish and receive its wisdom and guidance in return. When you finish your conversation, offer your plant spirit guide a drink from the pond. There's a watering can nearby. 